and welcome to the kitchen where the cook-off is about to begin. We have CCB Karkur and CCB Batik here, um, and they're going to be cooking off against each other. They both have this, this beef uh, pepper steak. Yeah, That's their meat main yeah. ingredient. And now they're going to draw from this bag um, their, <laughs> their extra yeah. ingredients that they can use to, to make a sauce and some sides and, and possibly cook up a nice dish. Um, I put in some of the traditional stuff into this bag and then I gave them also a couple of curveballs. Now, um, you're both extremely experienced cooks, right? Yes, 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 yes. 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 I so, watched Nigel Lawson like 10 times. It's like, yes, yeah, so, so. so you pretty much know everything there is to know about, about cooking. So I'm just gonna... Do you have any preference on who goes first? Like picking an ingredient? You can go first, my dad. Ladies <laughs> first. All right, so, so you can just put your hand in here and just grab something. And no can chicken. I? Yeah, you can go down. Oh. What is that? Oh, onion. 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 Good thing. It's one of the basic okay. ones. Like. Yeah. Okay. It's nice. now your turn. They're going. They're going for it. Like way down. Is this? <gasps> oh, potatoes. Potatoes. <laughs> All right. Mm. Score for Christian. So it's five a piece that you get. Oh no. Oh, oh watermelon. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's one of the curveballs in yeah. there. Let's see. Uh, what is this? Chili. Chili? Chili. Okay. This is actually, this is not supposed to be in here, oh, but like... I want to do that. <laughs> okay. Oh, some sweet peppers. <laughs> sweet, sweet peppers. It's not, it's not they're hot. They're not hot. Okay. No, they're sweet. I might be lying, I'm not sure. No. Maybe they're we'll super hot. Let's we'll check this out. Apples. apples. Ooh, what are you going to do with those apples? I'm just wondering if... Uh, Oh, tomatoes. tomatoes, yeah, it's, it's pretty basic. So keep going, keep going. Mm -hmm. Let's go this. Nah. So some uh, <laughs> some pickled herring. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, yes. That was going so well until yes. now. Some garlic, okay. okay. I have, I have some nice, of that. nice garlic. Spices. You can share if you want to. <laughs> A coconut. <laughs> Coconut. <laughs> <laughs> yes, congratulations. This is some crucial advanced here. You, you, you know. got the coconut. Um, actually split pretty evenly, uh, uh, coconut oh. and watermelon. You keep going. You get the salad, and then the only thing that's left is the mushrooms. Oh. That's going to go to you. So, so these are the ingredients that you have, just to run over them real quick. You have some hot chili peppers, some potatoes, some mushrooms, some pickled herring, a coconut, and a couple of apples. Uh, while well, CCP Karkut here has uh, some tomatoes, some garlic, some onion, some salad, and some sweet uh, peppers, and half a watermelon. So we're gonna let them get to it and start cooking and check in on them um, in, a, in a little bit. Um, I, before we kind of leave, I want, to get, um, I want to get your first thoughts on what you're gonna make here. Uh, I think I'm just gonna take the, like, cut this down put this uh, together on the on the okay. uh, an our pan and still a uh, pan before but yes, they only have, only have one, one pan yeah. which is pretty funny but one of them will just use a pot and they only have one stove top each yeah yes yeah, so anything and then, else? then the rest is gonna be a, like just a salad a nice salad you, yeah, you it depends if this is hot or not yes yeah, so you're just gonna have to taste it yeah if it's hot it's gonna probably go just on just open the it and like yeah, yeah just take a bite yes what about you, Patrick? Uh, what is your first thought with... I was on a winning team when I got the potatoes. That was simple. Uh, but then the herring uh, came in. So I don't eat herring. It's Norwegian. Shouldn't eat anything that comes from Norway. Uh, and so, like, I have no bloody idea what a passion for food. Yes. That's not the thing I think about herring. So um, I'm interested in what you're going to do with the coconut. Are you going to use the coconut in the cell for just the milk? Or... or, or? I'm equally as baffled as you, so we will see. <laughs> so I don't even know how to open a coconut. No, I was actually thinking, how the f <laughs> how do I bloody open it? <laughs> so, uh, so that's going to be interesting. We yeah. might, uh, check Maybe you can shoot it in Dolans. Yeah, <laughs> like, just shoot it at Dolan. Yeah, as fast in the yeah, paintball. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah, but uh, so uh, I'm not going to delay you any further. Um, you can just get to it. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna keep. Yeah. Yes, so, so we're going to cut now over to uh, Svenny, or, or CCV Guard, who has uh, not quite yet, I hear. 
Um, we're, we're not, we're not going to cut there quite yet, apparently. <laughs> CCP card is not ready because he's not on his toes. Now we can. That was awkward. So we're going to get started in here. We'll cut back if there's something interesting happening, like uh, CCP Bathic here opening the coconut. But we'll go over to CCP card who has UFC fighter, UFC fighter Gunnar Nelson sitting next to him. Um, Gunnar is going to be doing some grappling with us later on. But right now we're going to do a short interview and uh, talk about him. Uh, Talk about the UFC with him and so on. Thank you. Hello there. Welcome back to the kitchen. Everything is crazy in here with these two rushing to get at it and properly make a good dish out of these, well, horrible ingredients in such a short time. Steak is actually pretty good. So, CCP Batik, why don't you go over what you have for us here? What have you been doing? Uh, so this is going to be the same part of the meal, at least. So potatoes, uh, mushrooms, a little bit of olive oil, uh, salt, peppers, put in the oven, like 30 minutes, 20 minutes, get it all brown and crispy, yeah. good looking. Um, a little bit of chili, black and green and red, just okay. spice it up a little bit. That's going in the oven, and then the apple, coconut, and the steak has to do something. Yes. But he's very friendly. So, so I heard you had like an interesting idea for the herring. Like yeah. If, if, uh, like what you what you were gonna do there? What what is your thought with so, that? So uh, I'm thinking uh, of like because I have extensive knowledge about cuisine all over the world. Yes. Uh, I'm going to make a Norwegian uh, surf and turf. Norwegian surf and turf. Yes. yes so it's a steak with a uh, little bit of fried herring on top. Yes. This is what the oil barons in Norway eat every morning. Oh. Yes. And yeah. they invest their uh, oil money every day and eat this. And it's, that's, it's that's a great way to live. And, and everyone should be like Norway. That's interesting. Yeah. So uh, we're going to let you keep on trucking here uh, and throw these in the oven. We're going to go over here to uh, CCP Karkut. You've yes. been crying a lot. Yes. Um, is that because you feel like you've already lost or is there another reason? Uh, yes. I just don't feel very good about this competition, so I've been crying a little bit. <laughs> but it, maybe it has something to do with the, the onion I was just cutting. Did you feel so bad for the onion that you just started yes, yes. crying? I was cutting in it. And <laughs> so you have, you have like, now you have this, uh, this kind onion, of garlic, onion, garlic yeah. onion and garlic stew yeah. mixing right there. Uh, what are your plans with that? Uh, I'm just going to put it on the, on the pan there yes. and just kind of brown it or something yeah. and put some nice. cream on it and then gonna get a sauce I don't working know. We'll, we'll see yeah it's yeah. gonna be interesting I'm, I'm not sure what to do with this if I should put it in a salad or is, is it, it is it hot this. or is it sweet it's sweet okay so I think yes. I'm gonna put, like just cut it down and put, do like a nice salad with this yeah so how nice it will be, but yeah. Have you thought at all about sharing some of your ingredients with seasoning? No, sharing uh, this for like, no. women. I kind of want <laughs> this mushrooms, but we're not sharing, so. Oh, okay, no. okay. So it's pretty hectic in here. That's uh, that's pretty obvious. Yes, we're very good at cooking too. Okay. So, <laughs> like, if we come over here a little bit, uh, Mr. Logic Pro on the camera. Um, and we take a look in the oven. We can see uh, how things are going with the uh, potatoes and the mushrooms. They're becoming nice and brown and, and moist. They're drinking in that oil and all those different flavors. Um, something I forgot to mention for you, dear audience, earlier is um, they have access to a lot of spices and stuff over, over here in the kitchen. So we have that everywhere in the CCP kitchen. We have spices and we have olive oil and salt and pepper and thyme and, and, and whatnot. So we're going to hover around here for a second and kind of watch these guys work and admire them. Um, the skills. Yeah, it looks like um, CCP Batik here is, he's just <laughs> doing perfect apple slices. I mean, Gordon Ramsay couldn't even say no to these apple slices. I don't know, like I don't do like a, I don't do a good Gordon Ramsay impression, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would just be screaming at you right now. It would be really Me. funny. Just yes, oh. and just be really mean. <laughs> I thought I was doing something really wrong. But what are I, you I doing? Probably, probably am. So you're slicing it down. Are you no, gonna are yeah. you gonna bash it a little bit, make it a little bit thinner so it's no. quicker to? Uh, it's. I was reading the instructions. Yeah. And it said to cut it down to two uh, centimeters. Yeah. And oops. Then I just realized this is probably two centimeters, so I can probably just put it like that. Yes. So I probably don't have to cut it down. So you're reading the instructions on the yes. outside of a beef steak. Yes, because I don't know how to make I thought you were steak. culinary experts, both I'm of not. you. Or yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I just of want to do like it says on the... So, 
So I heard CCB Dolan had some tips and so, tricks on how to open a coconut earlier. Well, uh, uh, the community might know that CCB Dolan is usually full of shit. So uh, I suspect that is the case here. Okay. But he was suggesting that we operate on the poor coconut here. Okay. Then drain the liquid from the poor thing's life. Yes. And then we find a seam. Like, he must have been stuck on some Christopher Columbus uh, Island one shot in time. Seam and, that's right and here. And then we try to break it, like... Yes. I, I think I'm, that's usually how it's done. Yes, okay, yeah. yeah I've never done this myself, so... Um, I kinda, you need to so learn cute. how to you learn, like, need to learn how to like, cook and talk. Yeah, like I don't know. I'm, it's gonna be sad losing this fellow, but uh, yes. this is gonna be the second part. Um, I'm imagining maybe we can just coconut and apples. It has together. it has a beard, pretty much. Yeah, 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 it's like it's my little like yes, child, like love child. So it would be sad to lose it. But uh, I'm not even sure if coconuts and apples go together, but they must. It's just sure they do. Nature, why, so why not? Yep. They're both from nature. And we know that everything in nature goes well, well together. together. Yeah, like, this, is, yes. this is proven. Like, like fire ants and humans, yes. best friends. Uh, and I think they it discovered like uh, intelligent design from that way. Like everything yes. goes together in nature, oh, yes. so it must of make sense. So. Of course. So, CCB Karkar, what are you looking for? She's running I frantically around the kitchen. I'm not sure kitchen. if this is the oil to cook from. What that's, that's, it's fine. What, what do you mean? It's good. It might be like a bit heavy on the Store garlic. Store in dark place away from heat. Yes, it's, it's, it's oil. For olive oil and garlic. Too. I think it's fine. Yes. This uh, is fine. Don't panic, I'll my darling. I'll just use it. Yeah. Are you going to uh, fry the steak now? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, no, okay, sorry, I shouldn't like... Uh, so like, when, when I was talking to, to our kitchen staff about this, by the way, this heats up really, really fast, and oh. it's going to be a really, really hot stove, oh. which is good. So you want, to, you want to cook beef at a high temperature because you want to close the meat properly to keep all the, all the savory flavor in there um, while, while heating it all the way through. So you want to properly close the meat, and you want to get both sides flipped over. Yeah. Um, so... CCB Batik has resorted, uh, resorted to just eating the apples. Instead of <laughs> killing the coconut, he's just eating the apples. So, yeah, this coconut. Shall we try it? Oh, yeah, let's, let's watch this closely as he tries to, open, missed, my fellow. Uh -huh. tries to open the, the coconut. You do have this hammer here that you could just kind of go... Yeah, but if it's hammer. got liquid yes. in it, it's going to blow up, right? I, know. I think. I'm or? not the one that cleans up, it's you guys. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm also <laughs> thinking. So, so what about just using the hammer yeah, on the back it. of this thing? No, like just to hammer the yes, thing this, in. Yes, I, I can see how this will end. Great. No progress. Ooh. Score. Ah, I'm okay. pretty much the smartest one in here. Now we need a glass. Do we have a glass? Um, Get yes. me a glass, good sir. <laughs> so, uh, CCB Batik just called. CCB Dolan, good sir. It's probably the first time those words have been uttered towards CCB Dolan in his he life. He feels better afterwards, so how yes. about that? Um, I have no idea what you say. So, oh, this is looking this nice. Is and one for yes. there. So yeah. you have a nice hot stove here. Yeah, uh, what's I'm looking the for something on? That it's only on five. I'll probably bring it up here. Just uh, this is um. Could only this. this uh, Could you help me again? Good sir, we need a yes. second hole. I was informed. Yeah. I feel like I'm doing construction work instead of cooking. Ooh! Finally, that happened. Glass. Yes, so yeah. CCP Loxy just complained that we were breaking his multi tool and that he wants it, wanted cleaned before uh, this. So you should probably take care of that, otherwise, you will be barred from future broadcasts. Um, that would be a shame. <laughs> <laughs> no more cook offs for you, CCP Batek. But it, like, look at so, it. Yeah, so this like is where you get the delicious coconut, coconut milk from. Yeah. Imagine this. This is what Robert Crusoe got to do every day. Imagine how lucky he was. Yes. And now we break it, you said. May, may I make a suggestion? Break it in the back. Break it in the back. 
that. Yes, that's a good idea. So, yeah, actually, this is probably like what higher killer snow, uh, up so like compared to other killers. Yes. They like you, you hide the crime. Probably just do it on the ground before you just like yeah, that. I can't throw. If you can, you just throw it on the ground or something. Shall we try the first one? Yeah, that worked. That's like a, it's like our Easter eggs. Yes. Yes. Like of course, it makes perfect sense now. So, so we, we have finally a have a. No, you haven't no. even bested the coconut. It's no, still it's laughing it's at you from within uh -huh. its shell. And um. being scorned by nature here <laughs> in the kitchen. Yeah, score. Yes, now we have some uh, delicious coconut meat right yes. there. And I just as I say, I don't even like coconut, so this will be a good experience. So, so you can see it's like a onion. It peels layer after layer. Yes. Like Nigella Lawson would have said that, that way. Yes. Yeah. And you, of course, being the Nigella Lawson fan that you are, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, would know that. So we have some smoke coming up here yes. from you, uh, CCP Catfish. Yes. Um, that's the sign of a true master cook. Of course. So, I. How's it going? You want to? I don't really know how to do this. This is not. You probably, yeah. Yeah. In turning that around is good. Yeah. yeah. Just keep it moving. You might probably might have wanted a little bit more oil on the pan. Yeah. When you start it. It's probably a little bit late now, but... Uh, it's okay. Okay, that's that's looking little. fantastic yeah. right there. But it's good to we're, we're almost reaching the halfway point if we're not there already. Halfway um, point, okay. But you still have yet to prepare your salad, and uh, since we batik, you have yet to prepare your steak. So... I'm kind of requesting you in this pan. Might want to uh, kind of get to it. We still have 10 minutes, right? What? We have 10 minutes or 8 minutes? Or? Yeah, you have, you have 15 minutes, about 15, 15 minutes. 15 minutes? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Cow does not take a half an hour to cook. That's so, I will tell yeah, you. This I know from culinary science. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> it's, it's fine. We, we, we were just discussing uh, accidentally in Iceland because this was the right oil or not. Like, it will give you uh, a little bit of smoke, but that's fine. We're, we're good. We have. I thought we had good ventilation in here, but maybe we just don't. We, just have we probably need to turn cook. on the the air conditioning unit or like the thing here, because it's kind of filling up the smoke. Don't panic if the fire alarm just happens to go off. Um, I would say that this is getting close to being done from you. Like if you, if you think that it's heated all the way through. That is looking amazing yeah. right there. Just turn off your stove. Just take this on this side. Let that kind of simmer. So it's so interesting. So what we're what we're doing yeah. now? What you're doing now is you're doing a coconut uh, apple salad. Yeah, a side. A like, side salad. Yes. This is when the Norwegian wants to have a little bit of healthiness in his life. Yes. 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 So because so Norway is not backrot like Iceland, so they can import stuff. So, so like not yes. lack of apples or coconuts in in Norway. So are you thinking about some dressing for this? So. We are at lack, except for the cream. Yeah. So we might actually do a bit, a little bit of coconut uh, plus cream yes. and mix it over here. It might work, might yes, not work. Maybe. But I think we will go for this white creamy sauce. Okay. Be good. I can't wait this to be the judge in this competition. This it's going to be. This is. It's this going, is going to be, be crazy. like sampling Michelin star restaurants yes, all yes, yes, over yes, the yes, world, yes. Uh, from Norway to like. Whatever. Not sure which country. <laughs> um, kind of something exotic because we have watermelon and sweet pepper salad. I like that. It's going to be delicious. And you will come to a conclusion. If you were a Norwegian oil baron, you would yes. hire me as your chef. After Maybe I would. Um, 
Although I'm like, I'm not entirely sure that you're supposed to take this outer shell of the. No, coconut. that's the good stuff. Have a bite. Let me eat. Also good stuff. We should try some more. Yeah, crunchy like fight bears for your like Norwegian diet. Yes, that's very good. Let's uh, go great with the apples. Mm -hmm. I think so. We'll balance each other. Yes. So you're starting on your steak now. Now we're going to prepare it. Yes. Right. We're looking like she's having the steak rest here. Because, as like you know, beef steak continues to uh, cook after you take it off the stove for a couple of minutes. So. What I'm really looking forward to, actually, is is um, is later on we're actually going to be tasting some Icelandic delicacy, and uh, and and that's gonna be like some true Icelandic delicacy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you must love that herring smell. Oh, it's so good. Mm. I can feel that. I I, I feel like feel a Norwegian, Norwegian spirit that is about to strike gold in the Barents Sea. Yes. Like that's just about to happen. Yeah. I, I just see it in your face, ah. even. Um, so we need that. not as a pen, No, I was thinking uh, we'll just do just knife. Yes, surf and turf. So I'm going to this will be like. Can I get this started of for champions? Me? So we don't have any more like fire incidents. <laughs> So the case was that the pepper was burned a little bit previously when uh, CCB Karkar was, was doing her thing here on this pan. But that shouldn't oh, happen. Oh, my now. potatoes are ready almost, so we can go and start frying here. Yes, um, so looking into this oven, um, the potatoes are golden along with the mushrooms and, and, and so on. So maybe we can, we can maybe get a shot inside the oven after we, after we see here uh, CCB Patrick working on. Very important to yes. feel the meat. Like feel, to feel the meat. Feel the meat. Do like you massage it? Do you, yeah, do you talk like to it? You, you like want it ready for the transformation. Yes. So, so do you do you talk to your food when you cook? I talk to many things in life, so yes, food included. So yeah. I feel like it is more like so willing you, to yes. partake in the adventure. Yes. So you draw you draw energy from yes, the, yes, 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 definitely, definitely. Yes, that's that's uh, great to hear. Not good. enough people do that nowadays. No, I think like Ooh, that's gonna be really hot back there. Yeah, and you're probably gonna want to, if you want to take this out. There are some oven gloves up here. Yeah, we're gonna give it yes. two minutes more. So I'd say you have about seven minutes left. Seven minutes left. Yeah. That's Can I get the confirmation from the from the truck? How much time is left? Okay, seven minutes it is. So. Bloody good. Cool. Uh, yeah, this would be great. Yes. So, you're, you're continuously doing a stand, you're standing on the line for the camera. That's uh, never a good thing. You're obviously, even though you're a, mm, like a really experienced chef, you're not really experienced as a TV chef. Is no, that, no, no, that, no, uh, uh, that's correct a, assumption. Yes, this is one of the things I want to improve in general, like yes. to be the next Gordon Ramsay of yeah. Norwegian TV. Yes, so, like it's cooking traditional dishes like yes. uh, Norwegian surf and turf and surf and turf and, and so on. And so many things that yeah. good things come from Norway. Yes, so um, so I hope this is a really, really nutritious meal because. Just after this finishes, and after I've tasted and, uh, and judged what's, mm -hmm. who's, the, who's the victor in this, um, Gunnar Nelson, the UFC fighter that was just uh, like being interviewed. The big dude. Yeah, he's going to be... Uh, that's a uh, oh. noise. <laughs> so let's that, turn it that, off. That means it's finished, I think. Stop. Yes. That's yeah, no, no, then we're just good. It was a yes. beautiful sound. It was the sound of food being ready. That, that's you also know? your five-minute buzzer, just so you yeah. know. Uh -oh. um, so, so, steak over here, also. so Gunnar Nelson is actually gonna going to wrestle me and, and show us some tricks. Okay. Uh, is that sensible? Or? 
Um, so I just hope you give me the nutrition that I, I need to to properly uh, kind of face that challenge. Looking around, I have no doubt that you will. So awfully big salad you've made there. Yes. Seems to be a cargo. Yes. Uh, so this is a single person meal <laughs> with a giant steak and a giant salad. So you have five minutes to make five a sauce minutes. if you want to. Yes. If you want I to make it. I'm started preparing it. Okay. Are you just making sauce? Like, yeah, it's just going to be some garlic crap. I don't know. Yeah. We'll see. I need to I use everything. Right? I'm not so sure, like, we need sauce. I so what, what are you using this, uh, this finely chopped, oh, oh I see, oh. as garnish, uh, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes. So that's, like, that's amazing, that we the do ingenuity, what you said, right? We have yeah. uh, but like not being an experienced TV yes. chef, and like we, this is what makes yes. the experience. Yes. Of course, of course. Beautiful, beautiful. It, it looks like uh, it's covered with snow, yes, which is Christmas. really Christmas. fitting. Christmas? It's, it's the Christmas spirit, spirit kind of, yeah. yes. I, I like it. I like yeah. it. You uh, you're, you're definitely making an impression with that. Yeah, I um, think uh, I will be the best looking steak tonight. Uh, I'm you you will be the best looking steak possibly. Um, so we might need to go catch you guys some serving plates. Um, yeah, we now. need to do that. So so you guys can serve up the dish. I'm gonna do that real quick. You're gonna talk the audience through what mm -hmm. you're doing uh, a little bit. Uh, don't talk over each other, even though there's fierce competition. But yes. I'm gonna get you some plates to serve your dishes on. All right. I'm really confident. How are you? I'm not. Not very confident. No, I just thought about my sauce, yeah. and I can't really see how a sauce with uh, would improve your. No, thing. like how a sauce with garlic and uh, uh, onion is going to be good. I don't see that happening. So lobster. You so only that's need about to three minutes. For like a Two minutes. That's about three minutes. Two minutes. Three minutes, okay. Yes, I, I'm giving you a no, like slight leeway here. What did I uh, see? Don't, don't forget your potatoes, they're in the oven. Uh, yep. You can't let those burn. That's a serious point deduction right there. That's potatoes, that's not a good thing. Uh, I'm getting two minutes shouted in my ear. Two minutes? Yes. Then with a herring goes Lucky on. Lucky you that this, uh, this will heat up really fast, so you can just throw the onion in there. Huh. Just put it on in there. Whoa, that's a lot of. I don't know, that's amazing. Yes, so, so do we have um, something to protect yourself from the heat? Um, yes, that's that's up here. That's up there. Excellent. Just grab one. This is probably what astronauts use to yes. protect themselves from this the actually, vacuum and. and Oh, it's directly from NASA. Directly from NASA. I just can't resist watermelon. That's actually one advantage that season carpet has. Look at this. This is they look a bit dry. No, 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 no. no. Um, I'm not gonna lie. It's crusty on the outside, and it's gonna be soft in the inside. Okay. That is what we want out of potatoes. Okay. And you're and going for a bit of a more slow cooked steak. Yeah, I want it. I'm, I'm a little bit worried that uh, CCP cut. I don't think this pot, works. Uh, no, it just steak it's just heats the pot. Warm. It's like oh. it's, it uses mag uses magnetism. Use magnet magnetic force. You can feel it. Should be hot. So yes, it's hot. Yes. So this should be ready. So. I'll just up the heat a little bit. Last this minute! Oh my god! That last minute. So I'll just turn off this oven. And we'll just keep it open to uh, kind of let the warmth escape. Oof, look at those meals. I need to find myself a knife and fork to uh, eat this with. I'm looking, I'm, I'm, I'm so looking forward to uh, having it. Oh, you're lightly frying the herring. Of course. Just a, just a, just a close a little the texture touch. and yes. it's like all of these fishing. You're kind of you're making it, yes. uh, giving it 15 seconds I'm getting in my ear. For the dish to be plated and served. So, uh, I don't know. CCB Kapskut gave me some uh, two. Gonna to, just gonna have to eat it with. Yes, so I'm gonna eat it uh, from. So she's, she's done uh, that 
It looks like an amazing sauce. No, right I didn't there. do sauce. You didn't do sauce. You no, just did sauteed onions and yeah, garlic. Except they're not. I'm really sorry, Gunnar, but my breath is going to stink of garlic while I'm wrestling with you. Uh, it's just going to be one of the hazards of the job. I'm really, I'm really sorry. Um, Beat that. So let's, let's kind of get... Ooh, that's, that's pretty, pretty good. Gonna, you're going to serve the salad or, or just going to hold it? Oh, maybe I should serve it. So I'll, I'll start off on a CCP Patex dish. Um, go through this with us once again. What did you use for the potatoes and the mushrooms? So this is lightly spiced. We wanted a natural flavor of the mumu to come through. Yes. Um, so lightly um, seasoned. That's some mushroom and a potato. It will be soft in the inside and crunchy on the outside. I put it. Slightly overcooked. Ah, you just don't know what you're doing. Continue. No, slightly overcooked, but the the spices they blend really well together. Um, and what tweets me talk, talk to me about this side? So here. yes, uh, this is the apple. You were showing a sign of rich Tom, that you can afford apples and yes. coconuts. So and like. So and you guarantee that this goes well together? This is okay. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit tough, but like I think the apple brings it together. <coughs> this um, tastes like I'm eating an apple salad with wood chips. Yes, coconut in it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I don't like this. No, no, I, no. I really. But now for the steak, which is yeah. of course the, the main part that here. Creme de la resistance. Yeah. So how how do you recommend I eat this? Do I do I take a part I would, of the herring I with? I would take a part of the herring. Yes. Yes. Fish. So I so I have to like <laughs> look at how it's cooked and stuff. And I this would be so. Oh, it's a little bit red. This is this is uh, you serve this <laughs> blue. <A little> bit <laughs> red. <laughs> you serve you, you you serve this blue. The blue. Which is, yeah, uh, yeah. Which is a really that's, uh, uh, good like way. Um, turf, it's it's good. So it's it's cold all the way through. So <laughs> so that's 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 good. Um, <laughs> I'd hit the spot. Mm. Mm. The steak is actually not that bad. Mm. And the head ink. It gives it, a, it gives it an interesting composition. I'll, I'll give you that. Um. So the night to let lost one. Like. <laughs> um. Bit spicy. Um, the ink. It just came from the box. So, um, <laughs> and because it wasn't fully cooked through, it's a bit chewy. But uh, on to the next plate. Yeah. <coughs> I'm sorry. If somebody could bring me a glass of water, that would be fantastic. Um, what do we have here? Go, go over it with us. Um, what's uh, in that? First we have the steak, and I kind of also went for the burnt on the outside, raw on the inside. Okay. Uh, it's let's see, let's see how that's cool. Cool. Probably, yeah. And that's just, that's just served uh, on its own. There's like... Yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> I knew it would like that. <laughs> nice and blue on the inside, <laughs> yes. if you can see the texture here. And it has had a chance to rest on the table and become properly cold before I uh, got the chance to eat it. Yeah, that. it was always really warm. It was not yes. really cold. It's just because it's been waiting. It's actually not bad. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. It came out a lot better than this one did. Oh. Mm. It's not as chewy. I mean, even though it's a bit cold, it's not bad. So. Yeah, the salad is, I think that's gonna be pretty good. Yeah, so that's tomatoes, that's uh, some sweet peppers, some uh, watermelon, right? Yes, should be pretty fresh. Yeah, it uh, might be a good change. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then we have the onions and, of course, like <laughs> the best thing on the dish, probably. You have to taste yes, it the, yes. the lightly fried onions yes. and garlic in garlic olive oil. Yes. It happened to be cooked right before the deadline. Yes. So it's like kind of kind of shows. Let's give that a good. Yes. Let's give this a good taste here. I'm sure <coughs> it's really good. Like I, I, oily it doesn't doesn't yeah it's all really oily yeah. and uh, savory. We have some of the skin from the onion here. Yes. I knew you'd like that. Um, 
Rat just tastes like raw onion and yes. garlic mixed together. <laughs> and maybe some oil. I'm not surprised. Um, did anyone get it? Yeah, that's, ah, <laughs> fantastic. The plan was to make a sauce so, from this. Yes. I don't think that would have been any better because onion and garlic so sauce is probably not that It good. is up to me to decide the winner of this competition, and I, I have reached the verdict. Chef and toast, baby. Um, first off, you're both. Good cook. Good cook. Ah, yeah. You're, you're, you're like, I wouldn't uh, trust my life on your cooking. But um, decent effort nonetheless. I will give the victory. It's really tough because, like, that was really bad. That was decent, and that was okay. And that was, like, decent, okay, really bad. So it's almost a tie, but the kinda, narrow edge. I think it kind of goes to the stake. It's kind of the narrow, narrow edge because he took like some risks and uh, went for some cultural <laughs> diversity. It's going to be CCB Batik. Surf and tough, baby. Onion. Surf and tough. Congratulations, CCB Batik. I'm sorry, uh, CCB Karkir, but you will now have more time to knit, yes. and I'm going to switch over straight from this and uh, straight into a tattoo video that was filmed earlier this week where uh, GM Spider and CCP Lebowski got their tattoos done.